Onivia League of Legends highlights. First to the sad bullet time, kind of whole thing with Ori. So you're saying a Moomoo fifth pick here? You want to uh, some more? And get in there? No, no, I'm just saying style wise. Yeah. Ooh, I do like this kind of. Pick Actually, up. that I love. So it is. Yeah. There support. it is. Yeah. Find those support. Emily's Glad we're getting a successful gank off this one. Uh, top lane matchup gonna be maybe a bit different this time actually. Licorice has played quite a bit of trundle. Oh, that's oh. a good hook. Vulcan just on point. The ignite is down. Sven spinning in there. Beyblade from Hell's gonna grab first blood. And now Chime is trying to make something happen on the backside, but it ain't happening here. As Guardian's gonna proc and Sven. Yeah, I mean that that forces a flash instantly. The right. first dragon being picked up here now from Blabber. Yeah, very early, which is you know a pretty signature of all off there. He's Vulcan again though, of course. <laughs> just walks up and gets a flash. It's that easy. Walk up slowly. Impressed. And you. down flash. Oh, Vulcan. Trouble. Iconic turning back around. Shockwave's great. There's the kill they're looking for. Make it one back for a Blaze Olive. Confidence there from both Iconic. Still a great bit of pressure there out of Iconic to get a kill there Ooh. for a Blaze Olive. And now, bottom side, they're trying it again. This shouldn't be a successful gank, but. Pillar. Oh my goodness, that damage is unreal. Ignite is down though, Iconic gonna be forced to back away. The hook somehow misses and a Blaze Olive at it again. He's got no flash, but it might not matter. Blab a low, but not dead as a Blaze Olive. We're gonna make it happen. Sven goes down, Iconic taken over. So close to be. Wants a carry in that ulti if he can find one. TPs from both top laners are available if they want to join. All right, they got the dragon. Perks though, leaping into battle, trying to get something happening. Doesn't find it though, Iconic though, setting up the stun. Vulcan gonna be the target. Ulti there, Gravity Gun finds three. Vulcan there into the box, it's Chime that's in trouble. Dead to Perk, Shockwave whiffs. And C9 find the kill. They're going for more. Perk's in there again. Glabber with the slows on the axe. And He's actually staying here. And uh, unfortunately, Perk's joining the party. Is going to cancel the plans Licorice had. He spins in there, he's trying to win, but it's not going to work. It is going to be Licorice. Whoa! Oh, he gets a kill on the Perk's. Spins back on a fudge. Nice little trade there, but he had to burn the flash. Definitely didn't expect Licorice. Oh. That he could burst Licorice down. Put a lot of damage down, I know for sure, on the clone, but I'm not sure if he was able to get it down. Maybe in the next team fight, it could have a good showing. And as I say that, he goes in for the all-in. Perhaps this is going to be his opportunity, but Fudge is close to his own turret. So he has Flash. He had the double hop. He's putting himself in a really safe spot. Close pick. Decent little shockwave, but the guarding was on. It is Iconic that's trying to chase the kill into his van, but that will cost him his life. Vulcan, first of the scene, flays him back, and Blabba is going to take that Iconic. Shime is going to be slain by his van. Not yet. The ulti keeps him alive. The stick state getting zoned out by Fudge, who TP'd into the battle. I love that Sven went straight into melee range of Chime. He's like, I'm getting full uh, oh, goodbye. attack speed, and they get the kill. Well, we're gonna grab it. If he W's the wave, then he can go in. Because then that means that you only really have your ultimate as an escape uh, use. All right, Sven again being jumped up, but Iconic's not even committing. The Lantern's out now. They can recommit if they want. Shockwave on the blab, but Ragnarok was late. But Shime just gets deleted in the front line, and now the TP comes in for Perks. It's gonna be straight on top of Iconic, but Perks wants someone else. No, instead, he's gonna go back, stick say the target. But he's already a little bit low. Stick say get oh. in. He finds the angle, takes down Perks, but he gets punished. As a result, as Iconic found his way as LeBlanc, a very fancy ulti, but the gravity gun is down. Blabber flashes in with the sweep for an Iconic. This is going to get fished out of the air by Vulcan, as Fudge will take the credit for the kill. Even with the pickoff of perks, I mean, Cloud9 was always going to win that fight. And Wukong's just chilling. Set up for this dragon. Vulcan is just boxing out the entirety of Golden Guardians. And now perks, little sus on the face check there. But Blabber's gonna get the dragon, everything's gonna be okay. Yeah, they knew where they're gonna be out of That has to be in a safe mentality because enemy teams can just try and overload mid, try and make a play happen. And I think just throwing a Q and finding a play versus trying like trying everything he can to make a play, landing most of his abilities and it just not mattering. And now he's food for Cloud9. Well, Trundle doesn't have flash and oh, wait a minute. Perks with a nice flash actually to get out from the shock wave, but Blabber! Gonna be taken up by Iconic. That is 600 bonus gold. Drop this mid tower. You barely get moments where the enemy team's trundle pillaring you trying to find a pick. But Sven. And they're already starting it, so there's really not much Golden Gardens can do just to, other than trade, go for mid turret. They can try and feign as if they're going for Baron because they know there's no wards on it, but they. The teleport, Licorice though. In that mid lane, about to be caught in transition. Yeah, and Baron actually fully healed up, so now C9 takes full control of mid lane wave. That is a lot of damage. But Perks is coming back in, he's got a lot of damage too. Licorice again trying to make it happen. 
doesn't grab the play, but the fight on the other side maybe is going to be the one. Ulti had a stick save, forces a flash from Blabber, but in a 3v4 they couldn't get Whoa. it. Falcon has found the hook angle of a lifetime as Chime is forced to flash away. A blaze all of no ulti, everyone on Golden Guardians flashing out to safety and climb out of the map. Meanwhile, striking a play on the top side. Licorice is down, and the rest are just damaged. So they're going all back to base, and that division's been there from Cloud9. So I would say if you want to try and... Oh, oh my yeah, goodness. You know what? <laughs> it's, a, it's ridiculous. That's what sold his Dark Steel. Which makes sense. He actually lost a bunch of stacks. Yeah. As uh, 1v1, do not be fooled. As Licorice trying Meganar. to spin around on the fudge. Megan up, popping up. He wins this fight. Uh, yep. Yeah. Licorice going to go down. Fudge just stops Wukong in his tracks. <laughs> It is what it is. He just had a huge lead on that one. And now they're going to try and fight off this mid lane wave. Two waves crashing at the same time. So huge win here for Cloud9. Should be a free in hit. Oh, goodness. They are just busting through the middle. Inib is going to fall. Push is still happening. It's a minute still in this Baron buff for Cloud9. The Blaze Olive needs the death hat. But he hasn't got it just yet. And Cloud9 are basically putting They're really losing two, two inhib turrets at the same time. Love the feint from Perks, forcing a Blaze Olive back. Bottom cracked open, top cracked open, everything just descending into the Golden Guardian's base. Whoa! Dixie just gets exploded by Perks' LeBlanc. Yeah, flashes over the mid wave just to be able to get that kill. And that's a dead 80 carry for 40 seconds. They want to end the game now. Trying to end it in one fell swoop of the Baron buff. As Fudge takes out a Blaze Olive, that was what Golden Guardians were holding on to. They don't have either carry now. And Iconic gets a trade back and forth, but Blabber and the rest of the squad are going to pile in on top. Licorice is going to die. The Nexus is exposed, and we will finish with Chime in the fountain, wondering what happened as Cloud9 will take the 3-0. Perhaps expected, but the fashion in which they got here is very, very impressive. When I look on that stage right now, you know what I see? I see Fudge Factor. I see Playoff Perks. I see MVP Blabber.